Good morning, Cupcakes. It is a beautiful morning here in Zephyrtown. I hope your day is going wonderfully. Let's make today a great one. It's cold today. You'll catch a cold if you spend too much time outside. Ah, don't worry. I've said before, I'm immortal, and that also applies to illness. Like I said, I'm immortal, and that extends to just about everything. And, uh... Yeah, I mean, I'm, I imagine if I were a woman, I could probably do farm work on the, on the last day of pregnancy before giving birth. And probably right after giving birth, too. I don't know, just... Kind of a sneaking suspicion that I've got. So with the blizzard today, it's kind of the perfect time for two things. First, to process stuff in windmills, and second, to visit people in their homes and... See what they have to say at the current friendship level that we're at. Current number of hearts. Oh, and it's also perfect time to harvest these potatoes. And Oh, that's right! Since it's the perfect time to put stuff in a windmill, I guess we can go ahead and put these in, a, in the windmill for potato seeds that we can then plant. Now we should be able... Yeah, four hours! <laughs> In a blizzard, with a blue wonderful installed, you can have them done in four hours, and let's just, you know what? Let's just see, because I think this reduces it to like one-sixth, so it would probably be three hours and 15 to 20 minutes. Anyway, that's about it for the episode today. That's all I can think of. I mean, I'm sure there's nothing, no event that would be taking place about a month after our marriage to Sherry that I needed to that I need to mention that might be of interest to you. No siree. I mean I guess it would be more than a month, but gee, I wonder if anything in particular happened just a few days after we got married to Sherry that that might have an effect on the game. Hmm. Hmm, nope, can't think of anything. No siree. And I'm sure it would have already had an effect. It wouldn't, you know, wouldn't take a month, right? One month after that. Look, if you saw the title or you saw the thumbnail, it's, it's been spoiled for you. What's gonna happen? We spent so, spent so long on that. Oh boy. Ooh, shiny! I come out here in the, bl in the middle of a blizzard, and the best the game can offer me is a small coin. It also occurs to me that we haven't seen a lot of the married dialogue from these people. You look so happy now that you're married. It's kind of annoying. God. Kids are not like that, okay? Um, good morning. It if Cindy got married, I can't picture it now, but one day... Aww. It's gotten so boring since you got married. We don't hang out anymore. When did we ever hang out before? Listen, I don't go around spent hanging out with kids, okay? So, how's marriage life? I'll stop by sometime and see how you two are doing. And yet, he never will. Actually, wait, no, he comes by... He, 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 I mean, he, he was already by just a couple of days ago. Good morning, me. Snow is pretty, but I don't like the cold. I want to get married someday, too. I'm a little jealous of you, Ray. <laughs> Sorry. Everything she says just reinforces the fact that she is Chris Hansen bait. Hey! Ooh, silver coin. Yes. What was that? No. Hey. That was just some dirt. Some dust. Hey. Yeah. Hey. Ooh, can we? I guess we can. We can practice even in the middle of a blizzard. I wonder if this will affect how our snowboard controls. I don't think so. Yeah, this isn't affecting how the snowboard controls. This is just me being bad. Oh. 
If you made it this far in the video, don't forget to like it if you haven't already, to subscribe to this channel if you aren't already, and to hit in the comments and say congratulations for for the the baby on the way. I know, I know technically this is a spoiler, we aren't going to be there yet in the episode, but I mean, you've seen the thumbnail, you've seen the title of the video, you know what's coming. Anyway. All that stuff, it really does help me out, and it helps my videos show up in your inbox more consistently, so do not forget. That's some snowstorm. It's a good day to stay indoors. How is married life? Nice, isn't it? It takes me back to my newlywed days. Have you made wine before? To make fine wine, you need a stable environment and temperature. It also takes time to grow the grapes and other fruit you need to make the wine. What? Oh, it's you. Are you just wandering around? You must be pretty bored. The snow looks really nice when the sun reflects off of it, don't you think? Being around you just makes me happy. Thank you, Ray. I forgot we already checked her mar marriage dialogue. Anyway. But yeah, in other, in other ranch story games, you can't go out in a blizzard, but in this game, I mean, characters can double jump and... And Raul just never stops working. Oh, that's right! The cafe is also open on Blizzard Days, aren't they? Yeah, even though we're the only one that goes out. Oh, Ray. Hello. Hello there, Ray. Feel free to ask me any questions. Why are you open? Middle of a blizzard. Sushi. Ooh, nice. Thank you. I'll teach you the recipe as well. Not that we can really afford to be eaten out very much this week. This town really feels like my home these days. I hope you feel the same way, Ray. <sighs> That's really quite a snowstorm. Watch your step. Watch your step. You don't want to slip. How is Sherry? I hope she's well. She gets lonely, so take care of her. How is married life? They do say that there's nothing more important than family. How is married life? <laughs> Don't talk about the snowstorm, you look. Do you have any siblings? Turk's my brother, but I raised him growing up. I can't stop worrying. Yes, actually, I have three sisters. You look so much happier these days, Ray. Oh, wait, no, that's a different voice. I guess married life is treating you right. I'm grateful to my brother for looking after me. But I'm not a kid anymore. I wish she'd let me help out him out sometimes. This is the problem with having a variety of dialogue, is because sometimes snow is pretty and all, but the ice, you can slip and fall on it. It's so dangerous. <sighs> the, the problem with having a lot of variety in the diet. Watching you inspires me to work harder. I think that we can challenge each other to bring out the best in us. That is a little ridiculous. To be doing to be doing farm work while you're just about to give birth. Wow, this is such a great gift. It's a keeper, thanks. Good. Good. Hey. I'm glad we found something that she likes. I th um, what was it like when I was a newlywed? That was so long ago. I really can't remember. <laughs> Listen, I know you have other dialogue buried in there. Ray, you're always so inter energetic. Just talking to you makes me feel younger. I want to I want to see what he says about snow. Apparently, he doesn't have anything to say about snow. That's fine. My handsome My handsome was very husband in his youth. Of course, I still think he looks quite dashing. Communication is very important in marriage. Care for your partner, and you should be just fine, dear. I moved to the city a little while ago, but then I moved back here. Things didn't really work out for me there. Make sure you make time for your spouse. If you don't talk to each other, you'll drift apart. Outdoors during a blizzard? Go home! No. Claire has a license as a midwife, you know. 
She takes care of delivering babies in this town. Don't talk to Marion about marriage. She might get cross. Why are you outside on a day like this? Why are you open on a day like this? You'll catch a cold. Okay, but you're the one that's open on a day like this and serving cold fish. Oh. Why am I so fit? My father always told me that a strong body makes a strong spirit. As you can see, I took his advice to heart. Ah ha ha ha. How is married life with Sherry? Treating her right? Hmm? How am I doing? I'm getting by without her. The house does feel a little empty now. Oh. Look at the snow! Let me know if someone's in trouble. I will protect my town. Oh, golden egg, yes! But apparently that gets re-rolled every morning, so you can actually save scum to get golden eggs every day. And I know that because when the stream ended two days ago, I went ahead and I checked, and there was a golden egg, and then yesterday morning, there was not. There was still a blizzard, but no golden egg. We're gonna have one more harvest of turnips and of course harvest the potatoes and then we're gonna switch over to the summer sun. Oh, our pink brooch is done. Oh, this is gonna be, we're gonna have a good time at this bazaar, I'll tell you that. Man, that was a horrible storm yesterday. I hope that nothing got damaged. I was so excited to do the super lucky lotto when I finally got the bazaar upgraded to 75% this playthrough, and oh boy, it it was not kind to me. Croquettes, yes. 700, oh. I would like to, yeah, let's just, oh, come on. All right, we'll eat the croquettes. Mmm, delicious. Unfortunately, no tea for me today. Um, okay. we'll, we'll go ahead and top out on the herb salad. Thank you, I hope you like it. I hope Sherry likes it, that's what it's for. Yeah, when I started first started making uh, videos uh, for this, I was really, really surprised by just how many people were saying how much they loved the game. Because, again, like I was saying, when when I was posted on Ushi no Tene, the general consensus was that, oh yeah, it's just, it's not a great entry and all this kind of stuff. Like, it's good for, this herb salad is my favorite. I'm really touched that you remembered, honey. But of course. The general consensus was that it was just not a good entry, like it was good for new players that, you know, hadn't experienced like Friends of Mineral Town and DS and that sort of stuff, but I was really surprised that a lot of people uh, came to my videos to comment, hey, you know, this one's my favorite in the series, oh, I love this game, all this kind of stuff, and uh, it makes me happy that I'm not the only one that appreciates this game. But yeah, I'm always, I'm always glad when I hear people talking about how much they loved this one, this particular entry in the Ranch Story, or really just the Ranch Story in, series in general, because it's, it is an underappreciated series. It's not just this particular entry into it that's underappreciated, it's the series as a whole. Is this my birthday gift? I love it. Thanks. Oh. I'm gonna I'm gonna talk about Marion Marion's status as waifu, cause I'm married now, so I'm married to the best waifu this game would let me marry. <sighs> I don't feel very well. Well, she's not feeling very well, so I just go ahead and walk off. Like any good husband would. Well, to get Claire to help. Don't worry, I'm here. 
let's just take a look at you, dear. What's wrong? It's not bad, is it? Calm down. It's nothing bad. In fact, it's great. She's pregnant. That's fantastic! Congratulations, you two! Thank you, Father. Her child. What will it be like? I just want a healthy baby, honey. Call me when you're close to giving birth. I'll come right over. Thank you so much. Well, I'll be on my way. Take good care of her, Ray. I don't know if I did Claire's voice correctly there. <laughs> wow, our child. It's so wonderful that we're starting a family. Wait, what am I doing? <laughs> Feed the horse the curry dumpling and then take the horse treat and eat it myself. Mm. Perfect plan. Man, the, these daily trips to the cafe really... They're missing something without my tea. Because the reason why... They stop doing rivals in the game, marriage rivals, is because it wasn't popular in Japan. Apparently, people don't like to think, oh, well, I'm taking away this person's chance for happiness, their, their marriage, all this kind of stuff. But, of course, then you have to think about, well, now they just never get married. Okay. Um, but anyway, if you, if you had it where the... The male version, if you're playing female character, and the female version, if you're playing a male character, if you had them, had it where they marry the the rival of the of the of the character that you marry, then I think that would have been pretty good. You know, I think that would have solved the issue where you could still have rival events, but then it's not that's not an issue. Where, where? Oh, you're you're taking away someone's someone's wife or husband, and oh, I don't like that. But yeah, because because they still get married and they still, and they could even have rival events with the uh, with the alternate main character. I really don't know. I'm sure there's a word. Oh, all of our all of our cows are now producing five star milk. Amethyst, yes! Hey. I think we are actually out of gold ore, though, so... Unless we can get some in this river dive, then we won't be able to make a purple necklace until... Lloyd starts selling some gold at his stand. That, honestly... Honestly, I have such a grudge against Lloyd. For the fact that he, he never sells the silver. He never sells the gold. But I'm I'm working I'm working to make that not impact his ranking in the husband overview. Okay. Oh, we we do have gold. Hmm. I'm wondering if we rush to make the purple necklace if it'll be done in time. But I think we gotta give it a try. Purple. Oh wait, no, not a purple necklace. A blue necklace. The amethyst is purple, but somehow it makes a blue necklace. Okay, no, no, that's fine. 48 hours. Um, I guess it depends on how strong the wind is tomorrow. Yeah, the female player gets pregnant, and you still need to do the farm work, and take care of the chores, and all the animals, and all that kind of stuff while you're pregnant, which is... I was saying it um, earlier in the stream, that's probably why the original Harvest Moon games were male only as the main character, until they realized that they had created a series that was more popular with girls and women than it was with boys and men. Uh, not if you, Amir doesn't go away if you marry him. If, if you marry him, he stays... Uh, he goes, so he goes away in fall, 
And that's kind of the challenge of marrying him is that he's gone a quarter of the time. Which I was gonna put in my last video, in today's video, on the on the main channel. I was gonna, you know, explain, yeah, he, he he's only available... Or maybe it was yesterday's video. Anyway, not yesterday's. Day before yesterday. Anyway. Uh, but I accidentally said that he's only there two-thirds of the time, rather than three-quarters. I, I promise I'm actually very, very good at math. It's just... I sometimes misspeak. Well, I think that's gonna have to be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it, I hope the rest of your day is a good one, and I hope that I will see you later. Bye.